Welcome to the Zero Liquid Discharge Effluent Treatment Plan in Huasa, Ethiopia. This plan treats wastewater from textile facilities at Huasa Industrial Park. It is important for the region because it protects Lake Huasa. It is an advanced zero liquid discharge plant, which means it produces nothing but clean water for reuse in the textile facilities and solid materials, namely salt and sludge. No wastewater is discharged into the lake. If you're operation personnel, your work is highly appreciated for smooth operation. All treatment units must function properly. Let's take a closer look at some of the units. The plan is divided into four sections. The mechanical treatment, the biological treatment, the filtration and the evaporation. The sewage treatment plant in the back is not covered in this film. In the mechanical treatment, debris and fibers are removed by a grid chamber and screens before the effluent is stored in a buffer and equalization tank. Since textile facilities use various processes in their production, the wastewater contains a mixture of chemicals, washing agents, sizes, dyes, salt, and alkaline pH. Dosing acids brings the pH to neutral and coagulants help suspended solids settled in the primary clarifier. The biological treatment involves growing bacteria which decompose the organic substances in the wastewater. The bacteria need certain favorable living conditions to do their job. In the aeration tank, we supply bacteria with sufficient oxygen to do their job. They decompose the organic substances and they multiply and multiply. Most of the bacteria are returned to the aeration tank, called return sludge. Surplus bacteria are removed by sludge thickener and a centrifuge for dewatering and sludge disposal. In the subsequent filtration, the water is purified by a set of finer and final filters. Dual media filters followed by ultrafiltration remove suspended solids. In a multi-step reverse osmosis, high pressure pumps press water through a membrane to remove even dissolved ions like salt. The water passing the membrane is pure for reuse. In the reject not passing the membrane salt concentrates. In the evaporation, the concentrate is further concentrated by evaporating water until solid salt crystallizes. Evaporation is very energy intensive. To make it more efficient, evaporation powered by an electric steam boiler is done in a sequence of effects. The units are called multi-effect distillation, MED, and multi-effect evaporation, MEE. The product is solid salt that can be used, for example, in the leather industry. The Industrial Parks Development Corporation, IPDC, has taken over the responsibility for plan operation. Good training of operation personnel, lab analysis and maintenance are key for successful operation of this flagship zero liquid discharge plan in Ethiopia.